And FBI Director James Comey has called before Congress to answer questions on recent developments into Hillary Clinton's emails and her aides. One America's Emily Miller was at the hearing, and she has a story. Even though Hillary Clinton was not charged with having classified emails on her home server, Congress wants to know why five of her aides were given immunity in the investigation. So they called FBI Director Comey back to the Hill and back on the hot seat. You can call us wrong. You can call me a fool. You cannot call us weasels. FBI Director Comey was playing defense all through the four-hour Judiciary Committee oversight hearing. I hope someday when this the political craziness is over, you will look back again on this because this is the FBI you know and love. The committee chairman wanted to know about the immunity deals that just came to light last week for Clinton's chief of staff at the State Department, Cheryl Mills, and her lawyer, Heather Samuelson. Did the FBI find classified information on either of their computers? I think there were some emails still on the computer that were recovered that were classified, is my recollection. Republicans were unrelenting, demanding answers on why Hillary Clinton's aides were given immunity deals of any sort during an investigation into classified emails that Clinton had on her secret home server. Why did Ms. Mills request uh, immunity? Was she hiding something or was she afraid that something would incriminate her that was on her laptop? It does beg the question, what are you seeking and receiving immunity from? I mean, if you've done nothing wrong, laptops don't go to the Bureau of Prisons, Mr. Chairman. People do. Members of Congress were shocked that Mills and Samuelson, who already had immunity, were allowed to be in the room when the FBI interviewed Hillary Clinton. The American people are making a decision November 8th on who will be their commander in chief, who will be the leader of the free world, who will be the president of the United States. Anybody that would expose our national secrets and do so in a cavalier way, intentionally and willfully, uh, that, that, that we can't have a president like that. Congressman King also told us that he wants to know whether Hillary Clinton used text message on all those Blackberries and whether any of that information was classified. Bottom line, this investigation is far from over. Emily Miller, One America News, Washington.